It was a sunny spring morning when the old Zen master stepped out into the temple garden. The cherry blossoms were in full bloom, their pink petals dancing in the gentle breeze. Under the shade of a gnarled pine tree sat Koji, a young monk who had recently joined the monastery. Koji enjoyed playing his bamboo flute in the garden, but today a somber mood had overtaken him. As the master approached, he saw that Koji's flute lay broken on the ground beside him. What has happened to your flute, young one? the master asked. Koji replied, forgive me, I was careless and dropped it on the stone path. Now it won't make any sound. Koji was crestfallen, for he loved sharing his music with all beings in the garden. The old master sat down beside Koji and picked up the damaged flute. He examined it closely, then put it to his lips and began to play. But no sound came out. He played again, breathing softly into the mouthpiece. Still, no notes emerged. Smiling, the master handed the flute back to Koji. This flute is teaching us a great lesson. Sometimes we must empty ourselves fully to discover what is essential. Only when our minds are clear and silent can we be filled with insight. Koji's eyes widened as the significance of the master's words dawned on him. In his attachment to the flute and its music, he had not truly understood its purpose. It was not the sound that mattered, but the inner state it helped create. Koji now saw that he must work to quiet his racing thoughts so that true wisdom could arise. Koji bowed deeply to the master. He would treasure this broken flute as a reminder to let go of attachment and seek the space within where inspiration is born. Its silence contained more truth than any melody it had produced before. The old cherry tree continued to cast its shade on the two figures seated in contemplation. A gentle breeze stirred the stillness, whispering ancient lessons without sound or words. This is Narrative Dreamscape. Thanks for watching.